Guys, today we are in Maraca, St. Joseph, opposite the university, and it's the infamous, very popular Trini Nixie. We're going to talk to her and find out what makes her food very special. And I also heard she's a legend, and I want to know why. Let's go talk to her right now. Good evening. Hey, guys, you're just in time. Hi. <laughs> How are you doing? You're Nixie? Yes, I'm Nixie. Nice to meet you, man. You are popular. I can't wait to taste your food. When it comes to the right place, nice. and just at the right time. All right. You know, I said I wanted to try the polori first because, man, the polori looks so good. Pineapple and lemon chutney. Yeah. Let's go in for it. You want some? None for you. And it is ooh, piping hot. It's not your regular polori. You can see the bhaji. It's nice and soft on the inside. It's crunchy on the outside. Carrot and bhaji. Oh, yeah. See, Nixie. What am I looking at here? Okay, so this is the miniature version of a mezza platter. So yes, you'll be seeing a lot of Arabic, um, Lebanese slash Syrian influence here and there's reasoning behind that. Here on the plate, what I've presented to you, tabbouleh. So we have some grilled chicken, kibbe. I had this before, I like this. Yeah, this one is beef. I have also lamb. Then we have hummus, baba ganoush, which is melanjan. I want to get some of the oil because I like oily stuff. Yeah, let me just put that on there. I want to get that there. Let me just take this chicken right here. Oh, yeah, that. I don't, even, I don't even need to get to the chicken, but I want to get the combination. Well seasoned. You know, guys, I only know I don't do the pepper, but I know when a pepper tastes good. Back on the bread? Yeah. With one of the toppings. I'm making a mess. In the blast and hot, you know, it's a nice but, flavor. Well, go ahead. Cheers That's what I told, you. I told you. All right, guys, we have the lobster, the famous lobster corn soup. You could already see chunks of lobster swimming in what looks like herbs and seasonings and the, the color, it looks so golden. The texture is nice, not too thick and it's not too, like I would say, watery. Shred. Shreddy. It's warm and the combination is really, really, really original. I love. Let me see. Let me have a piece of the lobster. Thank Excellent. You. Now, the seasoning, the herbs, the flavor. I could just done right here with this entire bowl. I love it. Sassy is my, it's me. Wow. So it's fried crab. Mm -hmm. All right, talk to me. Let's go in and further. And steam dumplings. Steam. So you're getting crab and dumpling in a different way. Steam and dumpling, crab and dumpling in a different, different way. vibe. Yeah. Let me just come across here. So I get into this dumpling. And it's steam dumpling, you know. Ooh. Before I even get to the dumpling, the sauce. This is nice. For me to explain this to you, I think this is something that you need to really come and try yourself. All right, so I'm gonna <laughs> take. It's right actually laughing at me, right? <laughs> this is the magnitude of the sh of the crab gundi, and I just wanna. So you're enjoying crab? How you would enjoy it? Maybe even if you have a, like a crab, like a cracker, all right? Or you have pieces of the crab meat inside the sauce. This is a very own beverage. She has orange juice, grapefruit. I'm gonna try the Morbi. Couple of different flavors. Nixie is the food scientist, you know. Yeah, that's what we call it that from now, guys. Let me see. Nice and smooth. And it's not too strong either. You know, some Morbi just be kind of extra bitter. If that's a style, well, that's a style. But this is a nice blend. Guys, listen, the food here at Trini Nixie, delicious and absolutely amazing. But let me tell you something, you know what really threw me off? No disrespect, but because it's community-based, the food tastes like high-end hotel restaurant, like five-star hotel restaurant food. So it, that's what just keeps throwing more for every single time, you know what I mean? Come and try it yourself, right here in Maracas Valley. 
all right? And you could go check out on all the social medias. That's Trini Nixie on Facebook. I hear she on TikTok too and on Instagram. And guess what? I could not leave here without my own personal bottle of sassy dragon pepper. Your boy eating pepper. And, oh yeah, I find a pepper that I love. Here that is smoke and pepper. And I ain't even asked for none. I buy it. That's to tell you how much I love it. I tell you what, man. Hold that money. And I'm going to see you earlier next time right here on Foodie Nation. My name is JD. I'm going to eat pepper with nothing. Pepper and a fork. <laughs>